Hello friends, welcome to the channel digitalconnect.com. In this session, we will discuss about some HTML UI uh, things like, uh, let's suppose this is a button and you want to make it resizable on the uh, dragging from this light, uh, last corner, okay? So you can uh, uh, create any element, HTML element uh, resizable with the help of this logic, okay? So we will first ex uh, do the experiment with button and make it will resize it okay on the drag of the last corner okay so for that let's suppose we have a button with id r button and we have a class here uh, sorry css here for the height width okay now we will start with the logic okay so first thing we will write some css here for add on some css like uh, position relative for this button and uh, we have uh, overflow then so that on the drag uh, we don't have any overflow okay so we will done with this button to css okay now we will create a resizer okay so we will write a class resizer let's suppose name i will give the name resizer and we will have a position absolute. Okay. And uh, we will have the right, we will place the, this resizer icon on the right of this resize me button. Okay. So we will give the right zero and uh, bottom also zero. Then I will give some height, let's suppose 10 pixel and some width. 10 pixel and uh, we will have some cursor okay different cursor for resize okay so for that we will use the SE resize okay and now at the last we will need some color so B A C K G R O U and the background okay background color we will give some let's support green i will give the green background so class resizer is complete for resize icon okay so we will create the icon on this button on the uh, right bottom corner for that we will start the code in the javascript like let button equal to document dot get element by id because we are using the id here r button for the element whatever the element you will have to create the reference okay now we will create the resizer dynamically okay so we will use the document document dot create element okay and let's suppose we will create the div okay now in resizer we will attach this class whatever the class we have created with the resizer okay so we will attach this one here with the resizer now what we will do we will insert that resizer into the element whatever the element you are going to use so we are using the button so we are we will call the button here so we will basically append the resizer inside the button as a child okay now we will create some function function resize okay so there is a function we will uh, create with name resize and we, inside this, we will take the element reference here, okay, as parameter, okay. Now what we will call button dot style, we will set the width here, equal to element dot line text, line text position minus original button, offset 
left okay for x axis okay and we will assign some pixel here now similarly we will do for the height so for the height you will have to set the client y and for the offset you have to write the top pixel okay now this is the resize button uh, with uh, sorry resize method now we will have a event finder and function function init resize let's suppose init resize we will give the name init resize okay so what we will do we will do window dot add event add event listener and we will call the action event mouse move okay and we will call the method here resize method here okay on the movement of uh, windows event mouse move we will resize this and then we will set the false next parameter is false okay similarly uh, when you will have another event mouse up then we will remove the resize so you can simply name that stop resize we will do it later we'll create the next one method with it is called this one stop resize okay and this will basically remove event listener from the element okay now everything is done now the last step is we will call the resizer and we will bind the event here called in it in it decide okay okay so we will run this if there are any issue we can set it r e s i j t r and we have the create element e l e n t n t You know, the R button will create the C R E A T element. Tip resizer dot class name resizer button dot it will be in the event side. Sorry, this one will put a resizer here. And the, okay, now everything is okay. You can see the resizer icon here. Okay. and you can see that on mouse move it is working properly but what we need we will need mouse down here for the init resize okay so we will have mouse down so that it will not work on that movement only it will work when you click means you will down the mouse okay so now you can easily drag and resize your element so whatever the element you can easily work with that so you can see okay the icon is properly working okay so you can also have the div here or something whatever the element you want to use so now we have the div here okay so the div should have some background color so let's suppose we will use okay okay so now this is the div and you want to make it resizable so here you can easily do like this 
So this common functionality will work with all type of your elements. You can easily create the resizable logic here. Okay. With simple uh, JavaScript. There is alternate also with jQuery UI. You can easily use the jQuery UI plugin uh, and use the dot resizer with the element ID or class and you will easily use that one. But uh, this is the pure JavaScript code. So you will not need any plugin or third party things. Okay. So thanks for watching. We will come with another video on JavaScript and HTML. Okay. Thanks for watching.